everybody happy thanksgiving in the spirit of thanksgiving i wanted to record a video about certain um things that i am grateful for this year and i have a few and also tell me in the comments below what you were thankful for this year so this year i am grateful for my family and friends and i know Sometimes we take our family for granted and for what they, you know, because of certain things, you know, about, I've seen a lot of things about um, how, you know, Thanksgiving is like basically the trauma and stuff, but you get to go see family that's going to judge you and blah, blah, blah. But I'm grateful for all my family members, even though throughout the judgment, but well, they don't really judge me too much, but throughout everything, I'm still grateful for them because without them, I wouldn't be anything to be honest after God because they mold me to be who I am. I am grateful for my spiritual life with Christ. Um, this year I found a new way to get spiritually connected with God because as Christians, we all go through ups and downs with our relationship with God. So I have found the method that works for me and I've dived deeper in my spiritual life with him. Um, I'm also thankful for still being able to be here waking up every day all through 2019 even though the year is not over yet but God has allowed me to see this far throughout the year and I'm also thankful this year God allowed my family to add a new addition to our family which is Juju and she's 10 months and I'm grateful for her and everything that happened even um even through all the learning curves with her and the learning curves to come I'm grateful for that opportunity to have a second child because many do not even get a chance to do that because of things that happen during childbirth I am also grateful for growth and love um this year I've grown a lot I've um tried to change my mental in a different direction because um i started doing a gratitude journal to allow me to see things that i am grateful for although it's hard and difficult sometimes because with a gratitude journal it just allow you to actually simmer down and think about some things that you know we take for, that we, i it, it showed me that i take a lot of things for granted to be honest um my limbs my body parts like some people don't have those things so um I've grown a lot this year, um, whether it be thinking things in a positive note, my patience, um, and many different aspects, the way I view life, the way I judge certain things, the way I look at certain situations. And I know there's plenty of more growth that I need to work on, but from what I've done previous years, um, 2019 has taught me a lot about gratitude and not taking things for granted and um my blessings also you know like we complain a lot of times we complain a lot but it just allowed me to put things into perspective and to actually appreciate them at the moment and appreciate things at the moment and not later on when it's too late and things and so forth i am so grateful to be able to still have a home and that my husband have a means to provide for us with a job, with a decent job, a decent paying job. And um, because a couple years ago, you know, we were going through some hard times and um, we probably was facing not even having a home. So I'm grateful to still be able to have a home this year and to be able to pay all of our bills on time. And I'm also grateful that I'm, that God allowed me to have the opportunity to stay at home with my kids and to instill things in them as not um that are taking away when you are working mom no judgment against working moms but it's just um i'm grateful to even have the opportunity to stay at home it's not easy sometimes and um but just seeing my kids grow and the happiness and the things that you know sometimes i think Peyton has anxiety but just being able to be there for her through it all and not and having her to know that when she could get off the bus from school, I'm at home. And when she's going to school, I'm there to prepare for her. So it's just like the little things or whatever. If you are a working mom, shout out to you because you are rocking it and killing it. And I am also grateful. This year, the number one thing that I'm definitely grateful for, like I said, family and friends. But um, my 
fathers and my mother's um, brothers and sisters, they are scattered throughout the United States. So um, I have my in-laws, which is not too far from me, but I am so forever grateful that this year, all of us can be in one location. We don't have to go visit this person over there, stop by this person over there. Everybody's gonna be in one location, which is I have one aunt that lives nearby and um, she's gonna be with us. And then my parents are gonna be with us with, and all this is gonna be happening at my in-laws. So I am so grateful for that. And just being able to see everyone in one location is like the best thing. I'm thankful for you guys that are uh, forever watching my videos. And if you are new to this channel, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And also, um, I'm just I'm just grateful for just being able to, you know, to breathe and to understand the meaning of being thankful and gratefulness. You know. Um, Sometimes it's a lot, a lot of things goes on to where we do not take a moment to stop and think about this. And, you know, Thanksgiving give us, give us the opportunity to actually stop and think. Although the way that Thanksgiving came about, it came from a negative place, but just now being able to be thankful for who you are. Don't forget to tell your family members that you love them. Don't forget to give them a little bit of, um, a little bit more hugs today, a little bit more tugging today you know and if they're not around don't forget to send them a text message or a facebook message or something to just let them know that you are thinking about them and that you are grateful for them i love you guys thank you so much for watching this video and now i am about to go to my families to enjoy thanksgiving dinner so i hope this video bring you joy and don't forget to let me know in the comments what you're thankful for this year Bye.